feel like Vada Fly gonna recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the John bro. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That one was crazy, y'all the game. Sometimes ask Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the Vada Fly. When you start rapping like that, you gon' fall so many times, I'm glad you get back up I saw so many niggas dying, had to get strapped up I'm sensitive, I'm off the henny, don't you get clapped up If you told you know the code, you don't get dapped up You already know what it is, man, salute to the subscribers, that notification gang RiceGangClothing.com for the merchandise, you heard me right I got my dog with me Showtime SP to nobody that knows bodies, bah! So, I wanted, to, we, I wanted to rap, like, I mean, there's a couple things we're gonna rap about today But I wanted to start off with this Calico WWF song um, You know he's been getting a lot of reaction from it. Some people say it's trash He actually in the beginning of his song says, you know, they're gonna say it's trash I want him to say that like they're gonna say it's whack like he he he's the type of person that he's like All publicity is good publicity, right? The song is actually at about 72,000 views okay. right now on YouTube respectfully yeah. and growing every day and You know the thing is I've been seeing him and Rock, kind of like going back and forth. Rock went live yesterday or the day before. I'll put some of that at the end of this. You know how I do. Mm -hmm. And it was basically like he doesn't have no interest in going back and forth with Calico on no beats. He was like, yo, when I battled you, I beat you. Uh, my father, your father says that I'm one of your favorite battle. I'm his favorite mm -hmm. battle rapper. Mm -hmm. So I don't want to go back and forth with you musically. And he's saying that, you know, the people that's close to him. If y'all jocking this bullshit that he's doing, the trolling that Calico is doing, then stay on that side of the fence, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Because I seen him and Nunu had got into some shit recently where he was talking about her, whatever the case may be. And he was saying that when shit goes on, like, people choose what side of the fence they on, mm -hmm. and he wants them to stay there. Because he's like, when I see Calico, it ain't going to be that though, you know what right. I'm saying? Like, <laughs> and so here's, here's what I, I want I want to get your reaction on, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Um, As far as what Calico's statement was concerning... People saying that he was going too far as far as with the song, because in the song, you know, he's talking about this person got robbed, he's mm -hmm. talking about, you know, they ain't want no problems, and all this other shit, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? You know the lyrics to the yeah. song, right? I heard it. So, <laughs> Calico says, oh, so I'm supposed to give a fuck about niggas being sad that a battle rap world has turned on them. All they have to do is remain themselves and it will blow over. Be yourself and you can overcome anything. Stop trying to be something you're not and you'll win every time. He said, until your face is on an obituary at a battle, don't tell me I'm going too far. <laughs> I watched one of the greatest <laughs> not give two fucks about how I feel and y'all applauded him for that. What's your thoughts? Okay. Fair point, but I don't think it's the same... I don't think that's the same problem. Okay. Like, it's not the same issue. Yes. Uh, when Calico battled Loaded Lux, Lux did bring out a casket. He had an obituary. It was a funeral setting. But that was to set up. That that was at the battle that was already contracted to happen. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like, the buildup was, was Lux calling a funeral home and all of that stuff. Mm -hmm. That was set up for it to happen. Y'all have already battled. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, so it's like... The thing about Calico and how he does it mm -hmm. is, you know, he, he remains relevant by poking fun at other people. He also likes to definitely pick the fights mm -hmm. because respectfully, I, that's my new word now. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I like that. Respectfully. The you know what I'm saying? New York shit, by the way. You know what I mean? I'll let you have that, though. You can <laughs> that. But anyway, what's up? With all due respect, if Calico wasn't picking these fights, who's really picking fights with Calico? That's all, honey. I'm just saying, nobody, nope, none of the none of the rookies or none of the mid tier guys are sitting here going, I need to see Calico. Mm -hmm. Maybe a few, maybe some that are on their list because they want to take him out. But other than that, Calico's just doing what he's normally doing. He ain't doing nothing different that Daylight wouldn't be doing. Mm. Except for the fact that when Daylight was here, we want to see him come back and kill something again. The last time Calico was here, it was okay. It was also versus somebody. That was of God tier. Okay, the verb battle. Yeah, that was fire. Nah, we're not doing that. Um, not doing I that. still not got verb winning that battle. What? I had Calico yes, win that. Man. Come on, man. Like, well, 
Nope. Don't call me nope. tell me you get booked nope. for crumbs. I'm, that's just, no, no. Oh, man, it's cool. And then not to Yo, mention. Yo, let's go to the, you know what? It's you know all what? chemical hate over here, since, I guess. <laughs> since the defining mechanism is the app, you know what I'm saying? Let's mm -hmm. see how the app, we're going to see how the, how the app call this battle, man. You know what I'm saying? Like. Let's see what the app, what did the app call? So we going by the app now? For now on. That from now on? App. From app now stats. on? App stats. Bro, you're bugging. Calico has this battle. 1,430 votes to mm -hmm. Averbs 577. Calico won. You said 800 won. to 5? No, 1,400 to 500. To five. Okay. One. And on the, the damn little app joint where you look at the rounds, one Calico round. first round, second round, and third round. He clearly won. 30. Don't do that! Okay. 30! Maybe. Once again. You wrong. Once again, maybe Calico is just not my cup of tea. Nah, you hate it's, it, it is hate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, well, then let me keep on pushing the bar. I don't think WWF was that hot. He said what he said in the beginning. Yes, you were right. I was... Yeah, no. No, I'm not, I'm not going to go into why I don't think it was good. He was definitely dropping some gems. I think we should, though. This is what we're here to talk about. Okay. Like, Alright, do we... Alright, okay. The beat sounded like it was made off a of PlayStation 2 beat maker. It's Detroit. Oh, it's I, Detroit. No, it's not. It's Detroit. No, it's he's not. He's talking about Detroit music. That's what he's saying. That's what flow. Their flow is the lazy flow. Like. No, the beat though sounded like it was made on FL Studio 2. Okay. It was made with with the you know matter of fact you know the Casio keyboards you get to give to the kids. Mm -hmm. That's where they made that beat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No. Listen. No. D listen, I'm gonna tell no. you right. This nigga Calico be coming up with anthems though. Yeah, okay, so, okay, right. He came up with that anthem. First of all, I'm shouting, am I wrong? If exactly. I beat a nigga, I'm the same nigga now. that's in that. But I'm not gonna be, no. All right then. Okay. I'm not, like, not, not rappers w make music, but a lot of them don't make, like, okay, this is what I'm was saying. Was it the same producer? No, uh, no, of course it probably wasn't. All I don't right. know, I don't know, <laughs> I didn't ask, I didn't ask. <laughs> but what I'm saying is, mm -hmm. Calico is pushing the envelope you know what I'm saying? Like in battle, it's keeping the shit interesting. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm with like, that. Like, like, I, like, to me, is it the greatest song I've ever heard? No. You know what I'm saying? Is it something that's on my daily playlist? No. It's not even on title. I don't know what that's about, Cal. Why is shit not on title? I don't know. It's not on Apple Music either. But um, anyway, um, <laughs> what I'm saying is, he's using this to push his his agenda along. You know right. what I'm saying? Right. And then he says shit like. Uh, he said something like, mm -hmm. I think it was it was a tweet that he put out like, Rock wouldn't have lost his chain if he was with me or some shit like that. Mm -hmm. And that type of stuff, see the thing is, and, and Rock's we live stream, like with all due respect to him, mm -hmm. he was saying like, you talking about shit that you wasn't there for, you didn't have no part of, and that you wouldn't have done. So that's what makes artists mad because you're scoring points or you're trying to gain points off somebody for a situation that mm -hmm. you didn't have nothing to do with. Right. You see what I'm saying? And you're making music about it now. And it's like, you know what I mean? Like that, 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 like battles is one thing, mm -hmm. but music, like a nigga making songs and like literally doing songs and like streaming yeah. and people talking about it. That's what gets other people mad. But I just wanted to know like what the main topic of this conversation right now is, is what is too far? Like, is there anything, is the songs too far? Is, you know, he battled Murderland, Dark Life and you know, um, Mm. Said F you and your mom's mm -hmm. poop. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm. What's too far? Like I, I don't know what we're doing. Alright. I'll say this. What you say? When you're doing a diss song, mm. when it's on a track, it's the same it's the same rules apply as if it was in battle rap. I feel as though that when you're using the words mm -hmm. that's that they are meant to cut deep, but not as harmful as the actual action. You get what I'm saying? Like, I, I I can't I can't really express it more, but the touching, mm -hmm. not necessarily a bump, but like the bump is pushing, it's pushing that line, because mm -hmm. you already violate. Mm -hmm. If we, if, you know, talking about family and kids in a graphic manner, dr name dropping family and kids, that might be, you know, what I'm saying that's a problem. Like if. You know what I'm saying? I'm cool when you say I'll take your daughter and throw her off a bridge or something like that. But he said, if I take Tiana, oh, no, 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 you know what I'm saying? It's stuff like that. I, I mean, that's respectfully. I don't know nobody daughter named right, right, Tiana, right. but you get what I'm saying, like or stuff like that. But if we talking about figuratively, yeah, figuratively, like if you're talking about headshot your mom's sister, yeah, they gonna have the MOP and anti up. Like I didn't say Aunt, you know, Aunt uh, Frida. Aunt you know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? But 
it's it, that there is a level of, but there has to be some type of level of respect. Even though it is a bar where you're pushing it as far as disrespect can go, but there has to be some type of boundary for right. disrespect. Nothing. That's just I, it, how we've seen battles with niggas grab niggas and like. Toss the no, no, like mm -hmm. I, you know, what I'm saying it's certain, but it also depends on that person. Tay Rock is known to be a hot hit like that, stuff like that ain't gonna fly. It also depends on the actual person who is allowing that type stuff, right? Too. right. You know what I'm saying? So it, it's it's rough, but I, I said it the last time. Um, there is no fine line, it's definitely a jagged, it's jagged, it's right, cool right, on right, one right, end right. and not cool on the other end. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But um, my last thing is to, you asked for how much to rematch Lux, Calico? Yeah, we said 60. He said 60 for the, he said I don't fuck with, he said I had to tell him I don't fuck with Rome. And he said something about, see we was gaining, we gaining, we gaining knowledge out of this. You know, he said I'll I, do Lux for 60, I'll do 40 for Geechee. You just did, you did, okay. yeah, okay, that, that sounds like a reasonable price that you want. <laughs> I mean, you know what? You say 40 and 60, you need to tell him, listen. I go, Danny Byers would take that for a fifth of that. <laughs> it's proof. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. I, I, I rock with Danny, man, but golly. Ooh, we, you know what I'm saying? But I'm, I'm saying you make it a fight. If you want, like, make it worth the fight. Yeah, Nobody wants to see that rematch. I don't want to see that rematch. Make me make it interesting. Make, make it, it make sense. Yeah, you so make it can make, make me sense. Uh huh. Ooh, I like that. Ooh, that was dope. Mm. But it's got to. And um, I the, see the thing is, when it comes to Cal, um, when you understand why he does what he does, mm. you know the relevancy thing. Like he's gonna stay relevant one way or another. Because a lot of MCs that just have a very difficult time staying relevant. If they're not battling, they're not relevant. You right. Know what I'm like if they're not on a card, mm -hmm. they're not relevant. Mm -hmm. The thing about Cal is, a card could come out. He not be on it, and he could say something about it that's gonna keep him relevant. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? That, like, that, like I said, that, and he will said, always get credit for that. We had to struggle to find a new opponent, <laughs> and we had to dig deep. And is it a block, Captain? Versus, did like he could come out and say something mm -hmm. about him not being on the card that's gonna rile up everybody. You know what I'm saying? And he does things like drop a record. But Cal is known to do that though. Like I, 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 I can't. You can't get mad at somebody who is consistently. That way, you know what I'm saying? You can't be, you can't be trolling and then be like, all right, well, on some real stuff, y'all, you know, seriously. No, mm -hmm. you got to be 100. <laughs> and right, right, right. I, I ain't, you know, no, no slight or slight to Calico for that. But come on. Okay. That works. I mean, he going to continue to do what he do anyway. Mm -hmm. It's not, it's not like we don't get, like this ain't, <laughs> We're not this, changing not the, it. this is not the change of the guard. <laughs> like, yo, Calico's going to be a nice guy for now. <laughs> like, I don't see that happening. And it's like, you I'm know. I'm just waiting for him to kill me in this. Like, I know it's happening. Oh, you know, you said, you know, it's happening? Oh, no, I know it's gonna happen. They're gonna clip this part or they're gonna clip whatever I said earlier. This is what this little ass nigga was talking. This is what I be talking about. I don't like these battle records. Right, 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 right. <laughs> I mean, it, it is what it is. I think that you have a, um, I think you have a very a val val viable point. You know what I'm saying? It's like, you. I asked you because it's like, this is the things that are being talked about, mm -hmm. and is this record really pushing it? I don't think it is. No. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't think so. That's just my personal opinion, though. You know what I'm saying? I'll even keep it all the way tall with you. Mm -hmm. I mean, remember, the, remember New Jersey twerk and Loso was going back and forth. Was it? Yeah, was it him and Loso? Or was mm -hmm. it him? Them, them dishes was heat. Yeah. Beat, flow, everything. Right. Charlie dropped the diss as a response. To Hollow, mm -hmm. I like that one a little bit better than this one. I just like the talk that he was talking in WWF. I just no sonically, I didn't like the beat, the flow. Nah. You hating on WWF, dog? You hating on WWF, dog? Now, when have you ever seen me hate on WWF? <laughs> I know, right? You hating on the song? <laughs> I hate it on that. Song. Did he give any wrestling bars? He said till they started giving out checks like the World Rider Wrestling Federation. That's the only thing he said. As far as WWF, I think, but that would have been dope for you to like crash. You know what I'm saying? I like. So I think he called it WWF because that's what the beat sound like. That the beat, that, like a WWF video game. Yeah, you know yeah, like, on on, like, on, like Game, Boy. Like, on yeah, Game Boy. On Game Boy. Yeah, yeah. on a Game Boy. 
On a Game Boy. That's exactly what that said. Super Nintendo. And even they had that wrestling game in the arcade. That shit was dope. Get that 8 bit beat ass that out there. No. No. Other than that, man, salute to the subscribers. That notification game. Rice game clothing for the merchandise. Yerd! You gon' fall so many times, I'm glad you get back up I saw so many niggas die and had to get strapped up I'm sensitive, I'm off the Henny, don't you get clapped up If you told you know the code, you don't get dapped up